हेलो आई आनंद जैन फ्रॉम हनुमानगढ़ राजस्थान वेलकम्स यू टू योर फेवरेट श्रीदेवी क्लासेज यूट्यूब चैनल वेयर वी इनकल्केट इंटरेस्ट एंड कॉन्फिडेंस इन साइंस इंजीनियरिंग एंड मैनेजमेंट सब्जेक्ट्स टुडे इन आवर प्रोजेक्ट मैनेजमेंट प्ले लिस्ट फॉर द स्टडी ऑफ फिनेंशियल प्रोजेक्शन वील अंडरस्टैंड आर्ट एंड साइंस ऑफ सेल्स एस्टिमेशन एंड विल डिस्क्राइब हाउ मार्केट रिसर्च study of historic data or past sale trends and scientific projections is used to estimate future sales of any project we'll also learn the importance of sales estimation in project management so let's start sales estimation estimates of sales involve forecasting the expected sales or revenue that a project is likely to generate over a given period and this period may be a year few months or a week or the daily sales just like weather forecasting forecasting of sales for a project is neither a guess work nor it is exact prediction it is a scientific process of understanding the underlying assumptions which influence probable sales and to study all drivers of sales and eventually tracking those assumption and driver with great care and attention and also to manage monitored result to adjust estimate of sales timely sales estimation probably future sales or revenue generation assessment is typically based on market research study of historic data or past sales trends and they are basically projection of future demands accurate sales projection are crucial for determining financial feasibility of any project as these sales estimation provide a base for estimating project cost profits and cash flow for different activities the accurate estimate of sales helps stakeholder and investor to make informed decision these estimate of sales are used to set realistic targets and to allocate all the resources effectively and to develop a robust financial plan for the project appropriate sales forecasting adds values to decision making all across an organization sales forecasting provide a forecast for requirement of raw material main power and inventory management so finance department relies on these forecast to develop budget for the project and it also decide capacity plan and hiring for project activity the production department use these sales forecast to plan their production cycles material purchases management of supply chain system and they also operate their production capacity as per sales forecast available to them the sales department of organization use forecast to manage their sales operation with different territories and they also make quota planning for their sales teams according to the sales forecast for an organization the sales will decide revenues and management of cash flow and utilization of company resources greatly depends upon sales forecast sales forecasting can provide us early warning signs and help us to make appropriate adjustment as per long term goals of the company sales forecasting makes risk management easier and improve business planning in an organization goal setting financial budgeting hiring of main power payrolls compensation to employees inventory management production activity marketing and other things that affect cash flow all depends upon sales projection a good sales projection can provide early warning signs and we can adjust project activities as per long term goal of the company in this learning video in next 15 minutes we'll describe key considerations methodology and best practices for estimating sales in any financial projection and they include assessment of target market and study of 
कंज्यूमर नीड्स एंड प्रेफरेंसेस सेल्स एस्टिमेशन आल्सो नीड स्टडी ऑफ कंपिटिटिव लैंडस्केप स्टडी ऑफ मार्केट ट्रेंड्स एंड ऑल एक्सटर्नल फैक्टर्स दैट इन्फ्लुएंस प्रोजेक्टेड सेल्स and the methodology most often used to find out sales forecasting is historic data analysis or use of past sales information and market research now these two historic data analysis and market research take assistance of experts to predict sales forecast and in sales forecast we not only consider all external factors but also adjust estimates according to the changes taking place in external environment so let's understand sales forecasting by study of market trends first most important part of sales estimation is market analysis before estimating sales it is essential to conduct a comprehensive market analysis now this analysis involve study of all parameter of target market and examination of these parameter the market is decided by customer so for sales estimation we must understand what are customer needs and preferences we also have to understand and assess our competitors and also have to identify the market trends which influence sales of our project activity the first part of market analysis is assessment of target market and this include size of target market its demographics we have to study geographic characteristic of target market we have to assess growth potential in target market and expected revenue potential for our project customer is most important component in sales and marketing activity and a good insight into customer needs behavior and preferences what he like what he dislike what delighted him the best the age and income group of customer and the purchase history of customers for our targeted product or services to assess market demand is very crucial and for this we use market research surveys interviews or set focus group and study the needs behavior and preferences of those focus group so for our targeted product and services we have to identify customer segments and tailor sales estimate based on the unique characteristic and buying pattern of those customers whether we are a notable company of repute with good establishment or are a new emerging establishment for effective sales estimation we have to understand the competitive dynamics of our market say for example for industrial automation and control system market honeywell rockwell automation singer asian brain bori simmons mitsubi electric general electric yokogawa immersion they are leading notable companies having significant market share and there are some new emerging company with innovative products and better pricing strategies such as renovas a automation future robotics a innovation c corporation for effective sales forecasting we must analyze what competitor products are offering what is pricing strategies of our competitors what marketing effort they are doing what is their market share and what would be the potential impact of these competitors on our sales all we have to consider so as to get accurate sales projection and strategies for our company several external factors can set and modify market trends and these external factor can impact sales estimation for our project now these factors may include technological advancement taking place any industrial regulation which can impose on us or government policies that influence our working or demand and supply fluctuation in the market even seasonality can set market trends and we have to also consider the competitive landscapes what other competitors can offer to influence our sales target analyzing all these external factor helps 
to improve the accuracy of sales projection or sales estimates we have studied various factor and considerations which are important for sales estimation now we'll study various approaches and methodology for sales estimation and one very common and straight forward approach is historical data analysis and market research now looking at previous documented information of historical sales data is the perhaps the most common and straight forward and very accurate approach for sales estimation examination of historical sales data can identify significant patterns trends in sales and seasonability in sales performance and we can estimate the future sales estimation or projection based on these historical data historical sales data or past sales performance are analyzed as per product market segment or reason to understand the historical growth rate and revenue contribution for our targeted product and services use of these historical sales data is the most realistic methodology for an established company to find out sales estimation as we have documented previous sales performance data readily available and we can make appropriate adjustment as per the present conditions but for a startup or new enterprises when such previous recorded documented sales data or historical information is not available we have to make more creative methodology and to get other source of information for sales estimation market research is another common and reliable methodology for sales estimation in market research we conduct survey interviews and establish focus group to gain insight into customer behavior and purchasing trends and to get an assessment of market demand for targeted product and services of our project in market research if company or organization got a better customer relation management if its crm is good then it can fetch really accurate research result related to market demand and can help us to find out better sales estimation for our targeted product or services in fact a combination of both past sales information or historical data along with market research enhance the accuracy of sales estimate for any project several methods can be employed for sales forecasting it is always advisable to use a combination of several techniques to obtain a more reliable estimate of probable sales now the some common used method for sales forecasting are time series analysis market segmentation and expert opinion let's first understand time series analysis this time series analysis method use historical sales data which are already documented and realistic now these data when analyzed can identify the trends patterns and seasonability in sales information and the same data can be extrapolated to get estimate of future sales or forecast of sales using some statistical techniques and they if used properly will give most reliable and accurate sales forecast another technique for sales forecast is market segmentation now this will divide target market into distinct segments they are based on geographic conditions demographic divisions or psychographic positions or the behavior of customers as per geographical segmentation we can segment target market in terms of region country size city size population density or the climate of target market geography one important segmentation of target market is demographic segmentation this segmentation is based on age gender family size income occupation education religion race or nationality and accordingly we can find out sales potential in different segments and get an idea for our future sales estimation market can be also segmented in terms of psychographic divisions such as social classes lifestyles 
or the personality of target customers we can also segment market as per behavioral point of view we can find out occasions for typical purchases the benefit sought by customer the uses rate for a target product or services the loyalty status of customer readiness state of customer customer attitude towards product is also important so one sales estimator has to analyze each these segments separately to estimate more accurate sales projection and he should take account unique characteristic of these segments to get more accurate sales projection one most convenient and reliable method of sales forecasting is seeking expert opinion we can seek input from field experts sales professional and key stakeholders who possess valuable insight experience and expertise in the specific target market or industry these experts got relevant experience and expertise to predict sales estimation accurately incorporating their knowledge and experience into sales estimation process can enhance the accuracy of our sales projections during sales estimation we use some assumptions and we have to clearly define these assumption during our sales estimation process such as pricing of product and services the promotion channel taken by us the market share of our product and competitor conditions and we have to also assume what is probable growth potential in target market these assumptions definitely influence our sales forecasting or projections we also have to conduct sensitivity analysis to assess the impact of changes in these assumptions on our sales projection this sensitivity analysis help us to identify the key variable and the potential risk that may affect the accuracy of our sales forecasting so both definition of key assumptions and how these assumptions are sensitive to our analysis both affect the accuracy of sales estimation sales estimate for any project are not static depending upon various prevailing conditions they may have variation now it is very crucial to continuously monitor the actual sales performance against what we have projected about estimated sales and if there exist any deviation or discrepancies we have to identify those deviations and have to adjust and modify our estimations as per the conditions estimating sales for financial estimation and projection is a complex and dynamic process that require careful analysis rigorous market research and consideration of various relevant factors that influence or affect sales forecasting accurate sales estimate provide a solid foundation for financial planning resource allocation and decision making in our project management by employing robust methodologies for sales forecast leveraging perfectly the historic data available about sales and conducting marketing research and incorporating opinion obtained from field experts can enhance the accuracy of sales projection and this will definitely increase the likelihood of project success regular monitoring of changing circumstances and accordingly adjustment of sales estimate can make better informed financial decision throughout the project lifestyle so sales forecasting is very important in financial estimating and projections we hope this learning video has explained importance of sales estimation in financial projection and estimation we have explained all popular methodology for sales forecasting such as historic data analysis market research and expert opinion our other learning video of the same playlist are equally useful you can use them in your studies or share them with your friends and if you like dedicated exam centric notes for these learning videos do join membership of our shri devi classes youtube channel happy learning have nice time thank you very much